Hey guys, in this uh, video I'm going to talk about the circular catalog carousel. Now, as you can see, this is the element. You can find it into sliders, circular catalog. It's basically a carousel of uh, various items which do, do, do something when clicked on more. They look good, they uh, support various styles and I'm going to show you how to edit these styles and settings. So first I'm going to hide the header because I cannot reach to this uh, option bar and you can choose whether to, you to want to autoplay the carousel and the timeout duration the amount of milliseconds the carousel will pause and then we have the carousel items and the background uh, style options as you can see there's a background behind so if uh, you want to say choose a a style you can uh, choose here whether whether it's an image a self-hosted video a YouTube video and so on so these are standard uh, background options I've explained uh, about them in other uh, videos there's nothing too special uh, color overlay and the bottom masks now back to the carousel items you can have as many as you want as you can see here you can delete them move them around you can clone them and you can of course edit their settings so here in the general options we can choose a main image that will be displayed as a background we have a title a title a top label a price which is around here and whether you want or not the uh, content panel now I just showed you that when you clicked the more button a new uh, panel will appear with a lot of text and content now uh, if you want to disable it just turn it off this is the uh, text for the more button and this is the colors uh, theme for the uh, more button now as you can see here uh, you may have a dark background and you want these two bars to appear on a lighter you can do that by choosing this now they are by default dark because uh, as you can see these exact uh, parts of the images are lightened so it's obvious we have to have a contrast so dark is uh, selected now we can um, in case you enabled the content panel you can also edit its settings of course so you can uh, add a title the content text and the label for a read more uh, button and of course uh, the read more link you can if you delete uh, if you don't have a URL the button will not show uh, anymore and the last tab is the content side gallery now you can have up to three images which you can place them um, on to the right of the content panel as you can see here you can also define the width so well that's about it there they will be uh, resized according to this uh, this uh, uh, value right uh, here so these are the options for this element like I said you can uh, add as many as you want and that should be it if you have any questions feel free to 
uh, ask us and uh, also sub you can subscribe to our support forums our support team will uh, assist you there so thanks for watching and see you in the next one bye